Isn't he awesome? Crazy rainstorm, it was crazy. Totally use that big bow. I'm gonna have stuff on it. Right, I see stuff. What is this? Oh, that's kind of cool. Maybe I'll call Party City and ask them if they can politely box these up for me next time. <laughs> 
fancy another wine a little. Oh, those are cute. Sure, someone could use all this stuff. Nice. See what you guys proud of me? I'm trying to get everything out of here. <laughs> my grabber. Um, I'm not sure what is going on right here with this stuff, but check it out. Wow. This is random. This isn't even a place you would see this kind of stuff here. awesome wow two brand new rugs way. Okay. I 
should I do this? So 522 next year. Sweet. Can you see something funny? Um, if you recall that I, for those of you that remember, that I have a bunny that lives in the under the pine tree in my front yard. And look at this. Oh my gosh, we can totally put that under the tree. Thing. Brushes, what you say? <laughs> oh, I actually cut that up. My first Halloween. broke.
thing of the mugs. Broke at the bottom. guys let's get started there's the three candles that were in that box i think they were pretty much all fall scented candles except for that blue one and then look at all of this you guys oh my goodness i grabbed pretty much everything out of that um there here was a bunch of the plastic cups big stack of the uh bowls i grabbed those Little champagne glasses then there was three packs of this they say um, fancy another wine not just pour wine a little laugh a lot that's cute so there was three things of that nice stack of big bowls here and a big nice stack of the plates or the platters a couple things of plates this little confetti decorations there's honeycomb decorations door curtains there's one two three four five six of those nice uh stack of napkins here and the checkered ones and those so yeah i'm probably just gonna make a little stack of probably just a couple things here I'll tuck them away and then i'll donate the rest i'll just take them over to children's hospital um not the wine or champagne stuff but uh, they can use the decorations and and whatnot. I've, I've uh, donated some other party city decorations to them. So, and I, uh, I haven't been over there in a while. I haven't really been finding a lot of toys lately, but I do have a little box of items, but yeah, I'll have to film that. I'll try planning that here um, in the next couple weeks. So stay tuned for that video. All right, and so these were all the bags of mints. I did grab those. And then we'll start over here. This was everything from Ace Hardware. There was a light bulb, a light dimmer, switch. And then this was pretty neat. Um, these are to cook uh, wings, a grilling rack. So that was kind of cool. And then here is everything from Burlington. Um, there's just one broken mug on each, so I'll just remove those. Um, my first Halloween. A jade roller, some ISO toner shirts. And then we have that. You've seen there was that was a huge bag of uh, brushes, a bunch of paint brushes, and then we have these earbuds. These are pretty expensive, um, and they're there, so I'll check and see if those um, work. And then if so, you guys will be seeing some of the stuff in the auction. And then a bunch of these uh, cute little elephants. These two were playing the violin. One was playing the horn. Another one's just sitting there. I didn't see anything wrong with them at all, so I'm not sure why they tossed them. Unless it was, I don't know. I'm not sure. Uh, but another fun story, guys. Um, I have been needing a blow dryer. I threw mine away before I moved because it stopped blowing out hot air. So I was like, I'll just get a new one. And then I found a little one a long time ago. And so I've just been using that, but it doesn't really pump out a lot of air. So I was just telling myself <laughs> for the past few weeks that I was hoping I'd find one. Michaela got sick of waiting for one. So she went and ordered one on Amazon. And then I found this. So I showed it to her and she just looked at me like, you're kidding me. 
you find it after I bought mine. I'm like, well, you really need your own since she's downstairs and I'm upstairs. So I got, I found mine and I am praying that it works. They didn't cut the cord or anything. So that was nice. Um, and this one looks pretty, this one's a pretty nice one. I'm actually going to, let's just check and see if the price is up here. Yeah. Yeah. It was $24.99 and $24.99, that's Burlington's price. So, you know, that's a pretty expensive one. But yeah, let's cross our fingers that works. Because like I said, I totally needed that. All right, guys, so here is the rug. Look how nice and long that rug is. Oh my goodness. Oh, there's Champ. Get the first walk down the runway there, buddy. Um... And another funny thing, I have been on Amazon for the past few weeks looking for rugs. Not so much um, the rug runners, even though I needed them. I was looking for a rug for my dining room and my living room. But I still did need um, a runner, two runner rugs for this walkway from my front door to the kitchen. And the fact that I found these, and I mean, you guys, this was so weird. The store that I found these at, that was an Ulta and a pet store. So there wasn't anything around that sold this stuff. So the only, I mean, it had to have been personal trash because you guys seen the M&Ms and then the rugs. So there just wasn't a store around that uh, any of this could have come from. But yeah. And I was trying to even see if there was a store name on this, but there wasn't. And look at it, it was 26 inches by 96 inches. So yeah, so got two of those. That was so awesome. All right, and then you guys seen two of these three pound containers of peanut M&Ms and they were brand new and sealed. They were all sealed in there. And then of course, Michaela got into that, the sweet and salty kettle corn. Um, so, and like I said, it just is so weird because this, someone had to have thrown this away. So that was a, a fun find. And then you guys, you see the rabbit food. Um, I was telling Michaela when I brought this home because of our little story, and I'm like, wasn't I just saying that I hope that I find rabbit food. She said, yes, during your live auction. I'm like, oh, I did? So then everyone heard me. So that was good. So those of you that remember me talking about the rabbit in our front yard under the pine tree, I was saying how it would be funny if I found rabbit food. And look what I found, rabbit food. <laughs> so we did put it out there. I We, we kind of made a bed out of it <laughs> just to see, but... He goes next to it, he or she, and we put carrots out there and they do take the carrots, but I don't think they're doing too much. And then the lawn company came to cut the grass yesterday. So I was like, oh, he better not cut over our food. And he actually went around it. So that was sweet of him. You make sure that you hit that subscribe notification bell. That really, um, and comments help the channel so much. So if you could kindly take a minute and do that, that would be awesome. If you want to leave a comment and tell me what is your favorite candy. And if you do attend our auctions, if you could kindly um, comment what is your ring size. Because I'm trying to get my hands on some really beautiful rings um, and an, uh, a variety. And I just want to make sure I have... A nice variety of the sizes that you guys like so if you can uh, leave a comment on your size ring size that would be great all right guys have a great rest of your week and I will see you Friday